If you're a beginner nail artist, stop scrolling because I'm going to teach you step by step how to paint Eeyore. First thing you're going to do is draw a sideways triangle with a little half circle on the end, kind of like an ice cream cone. For the eyes, paint one oval overlapping the cone and a smaller one sitting on top of it. Draw a little hill for the top of Eeyore's head and a big lopsided oval for his nose. Add on a tiny little bump for his mouth and then we can get into this hair situation. Honestly, I just did a bunch of curved triangles and freestyled it. Add two lines on either side of the head for Eeyore's floppy ears and now we can get into the body. Draw an S shape with a hook on the end to suggest his front extended leg and an oval with some simple lines to indicate his seated back leg. And now we can get into color blocking, my favorite part. Now most of Eeyore's key features are already defined, but there's a few things to add like his droopy eyelids, oval pupils, and thick eyebrows. And since Valentine's Day is coming up, I thought we could also have him holding a little rose in his mouth. I wonder who his Valentine would be. I'm about to have to look that up. Okay, I just checked. It's Tigger. Apparently they're best friends. It's like an opposites attract situation. <laughs> That's so cute. Wrap up the line work with a few little stitching details, throw on your favorite glossy top coat, and just like that, you just painted Eeyore. Let me know who I should teach next and follow for more crazy nails.